welcome back to Fun with Aunt Nicole. I'm Nicole. And I'm Delani. So this is a Christmas box from a site called That Daily Deal. And this cost me $35.48 and it was shipped free. Um, it comes in this very cute cloth Christmas bag that says North Pole Express. And actually, before we even open it, this bag is actually a Hallmark bag and it has a price on here of $14.99. So I paid $35.48 for this with free shipping, so we'll get in here and see if we think it was worth the price and if it's some fun fun goodies. And so far we're doing so good, the bag was retail price $15, so. Yeah. Okay. Excited? Yep. Okay. Go ahead and open it. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> okay. The first thing I float. Ooh, it's soft. <gasps> Dibs. It's a blanket. Ooh, that's a nice one. Campbell. Ooh, it's very soft. I call dibs. <laughs> <laughs> we can put it on your bed. Okay. It's called Campbell Ramsey Plush Throw. It, there's not a price on it, but yeah. I would say maybe ten, fifteen dollars. I'm gonna go take a nap now. It is. It's very soft. It's a nice green color. Oh, Ozzy likes it too. Yeah, it's not a squeaker, Oz. <laughs> he likes plushy soft things. Awesome. So that's a win. Okay, I'll pick the next one. I don't see the snooze there for a minute. <laughs> <laughs> I actually have one of these already. But it's a neck and back reliever. So it's a little massager. We'll get it cut. Just be careful. Oh, all good. Everything's good. Okay, so like you can see on this picture, this guy's putting it on his neck while well, Delaney's doing it for you too. So you just I don't, know if I like don't it. spread don't spread it apart, just enough to get it around your neck, and then let it close, and then just back and forth. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> it does look kind of like a medieval torture device. It is a torture device. I do not like it. Now the one I have, I don't know, that, that kind of hurts. The one I have is actually a little better. Oh, it actually feels kind of nicer. Anyway, okay. Um, I think the one I bought in the past was like $15, so we'll say maybe 10 to $15. So this is by the company SPRI. So that's already over $30. Yeah, so I think we got our money back on this. Alrighty. Okay, your turn. My turn. Totes umbrella. Oh, it's a really compact little umbrella. I just want to take it So this would be nice to keep in your purse, or maybe if you're traveling. Like in a school backpack? Or in a school backpack. Yeah. If you're of that age. $24. Ooh, retail. $24. Awesome. Ooh, so, it's, yeah. And it's very polka dotted. Ooh, that's cute. cute. It has a little cover on it. Yeah. Maybe we won't open it. No. I don't know. I'm not that superstitious. Just a little stitious. It's a joke from a show. Should I open it? <laughs> sure, if you want to. Okay. Oh, it's superstitious. Just a little stitious. And I already broke it. He never trusts me with brand new things. I can I can fix it. <laughs> That's yours. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> oh, oh, I fixed it. Oh, okay. Good job. Okay. It, I just we'll just glue it. it. Yeah. And do I just like push it? Up? I don't want to break it again. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. We'll have to glue that. So, um, no, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> My umbrellas all have a button you push. Does this said manual open? I don't know how to work this. <laughs> okay, we. Oh, I think you just. Wait, don't you like push something at the top or. Usually just keep it. The... Oh, oh we just had to give it a little more of a push. We were a little afraid though after breaking it so soon. So that's pretty. It's a pretty pattern. It's very small, but I mean, it's perfect size. If you're just, you didn't realize it was raining, you come out of class or come, you know, to walk home. Mm -hmm. Or like to like go find, go walk to the bus or something. Yeah, perfect. So okay. I like that. Right, I think it's a win. Ooh, I closed it and I didn't break it. <laughs> okay, cool. Awesome. <laughs> So this one, it's called Free Me the Game. I don't, I have no idea what kind of game this is. I don't know if there's like an age restriction on these boxes or like an age limit. So I'm hoping that we don't find anything risque. 
I mean, I wouldn't mind, but I'm here with my knees. I'm mature enough. Okay. I Play the outrageous card game that pokes fun at social media. Phone off, game on. I like it. Um, it's for ages 15 plus. Delaney's mature, we can, we can play it. But you need three to five players, so maybe we'll play this on Christmas Eve. Yeah. So, yeah, it looks kind of funny. Make fun of social media. <laughs> I'm good with that. Um, I don't, it doesn't have like a price on it, but I would guess like $10. And where's the cover? It flew off the desk, so we'll just put it to the side and we'll Okay. Okay, your turn. It's not a board game, I think. Or I got right I'm pulling two things out. Okay. Oh, it's a Polaroid a photo bar. Photo bar. So like for when you have Polaroid pictures. Like does it hold them? Oh, and look, yeah. the price is $25. Ooh, we, we can, okay, I'm gonna use mini scissors for this one. Cause I don't trust myself enough. Yes, we have mini pink scissors hidden under the desk. I love these scissors. And these these scissors have dog tooth prints all over them because my dog ripped, chased me with these in his mouth. He's a puppy. <laughs> Never knew about that. <laughs> I mean, he thought he was playing a fun game, but... It's like the devil came out in him. <laughs> nope, nope, that's not for you. Ah, it's a sofa. Okay, So you can take regular pictures and make them look like they were Polaroids, right? Mm -hmm. So they're like magnets. Oh, so you, so they stay in here. Oh, okay. I get it. I okay, see, I said the blind man. Okay. So I'll show you guys in just a sec. Right. Do you take these off? Because they are coming off. I don't know. I don't think so. Oops. I don't know. Are they off on those? No. No. Okay, so it's this, so this is like a hard plastic rubbery type base, and then it has these magnetic rectangles, and so I'm guessing you can put just a regular picture in there, and then you put this over the top, so it kind of gives it that vintage -y Polaroid feel. One thing that I don't like about it is that, that the paper on the outside of the magnet is already coming off. Yeah. And we've had it out less than five minutes, so. Yeah, so we might have to glue that down. Yeah. But, I uh -huh. it's kind of cool. And I can't get it to fit back to the box, so I'm just going to set it to the side down here. Um, I mean, I don't love the green color, but I, like I guess it, it kind of goes with these walls. I like it if it's black. I like it though. Can I have Okay. Okay, so, oh. Well, this is, I, I don't have a Polaroid camera, but this is a Polaroid journal. I have a Polaroid camera. And it is a retail of $15. I made the mini scissors. So, um... I mean, I guess you could use just regular photos, right? I don't know. I don't know what it looks like on the inside. I think by feel, we have one more item in here. Oh, it's just a normal notebook. Oh. With a... So oh, a I guess so. Notebook with a little Polaroid picture down here. So maybe you can... I don't know. Document the Polaroid? I don't know. You but yeah, it. so you can peel and stick your favorite Polaroid here. And it says peel here. I guess it's adhesive. So, I mean, really, it doesn't have to be a Polaroid. You can stick any picture there, I guess. Yeah. Okay, cool. Cute, cute. Okay, you get the last one. There's... Uh, I was like, there's nothing. Oh. Well, I guess it, it's the truth. I do need to get wider teeth, so... I don't think so. It is charcoal... Is that upside down? Charcoal toothpaste. Bright white? Is that what it's called? Oh, Bright Bliss. Bright Bliss. Charcoal whitening toothpaste. Should I try it? Do I dare? Sure. Let's run to the bathroom. Wait, let me make sure it's not expired. Nope. It's, um, 06 of 2021, so we're still a year and a half away from it expiring. Okay, should we run to the bathroom and then try it? Um, sure. My teeth looked before. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> so how does it smell? Not the best. Please tell me this isn't like a prank that you're trying to pull on me. I had no idea it was my bag, ma'am. Wait, let me see. Smile, turn and smile at us. Wait. So it's very charcoaly. So, I mean, 
Yes. Oh, okay. Do your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so it's it makes a mess. Mm -hmm. You'd like me to um, mouthwash right after. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Okay. And how does your mouth feel after? It feels Brushing. like there's dirt in my mouth. Oh, okay. So it's gritty. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Um, I'll probably use this. I'm actually might tr actually try seeing this whitens up my teeth. Oh, okay. Okay. So our thoughts on this um, mystery Christmas bag from that Daily Deal. Did it rate the price? Yes. Yeah. Um. I mean, if we're adding things up really quick, 15, 10, 10, 10, um, I don't know. I can't do math. It's like $60, $70, I would yes. say. So, I mean, it costs thirty five forty eight. So, we got like double the cost yeah. in value. Um, I don't know that we'll use everything, but we'll use a few things. Yeah. I think what we will use, um, we'll... I'm probably going to try paper. using this. Yeah, yeah, the toothpaste. I don't know. What does those sell for? Probably like four or five bucks. Mm. There's no price. I don't think. Yeah, no price I can see. Yeah. But like I can use this for somebody's Christmas present next year if I give them a big present. Or myself. Um, I think we'll use the umbrella once we fix it. <laughs> the blanket's nice and soft. We'll use that. Jelani will use the toothpaste. Um, we'll have to play this game and see if we like it. Yeah, like the journal, the Polaroid thing maybe. Yeah. Yeah. So, all in all, I think this was, this was a win. Yeah. Okay. Well, catch us. Like, oh, and like normal, I'm the test subject. And <laughs> Delani was our guinea pig. So, yeah, so catch us on our next video. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you all have a Merry Christmas. Bye. Bye. You're going to go. Ozzy. <laughs> Ozzy, you're caught. Stop. Are you going to put that on camera too? <laughs> <laughs>